I'm Darren Ng. I'm the executive director of LAVA. Thank you for joining us. Um, I'll kill some time while I'm still watching the numbers go up. Uh, tell you a little bit about LAVA. Um, I'm relatively new as the executive director. I've got a little bit new of our vision. So if you thought you knew LAVA six months ago, we're uh, definitely a different organization. Thank you so much, Kala, and thanks for, to Global LAVA for hosting this event. Um, so several years ago, I was approached by one of the companies here and they wanted to understand India better. And they asked me, as is typical of an aerospace company, to write a long and complicated proposal about it. And then they came back a couple of months later, say, well, actually, we found another solution. We work with this large university, not Loyola Marymount, Color, another one, not in the local area. And they said, we are going to use their resources. And I forgot all about it. A few months later, I get a call from the Thunderbirds Graduate School in Phoenix, Arizona, saying this unnamed aerospace company wants to run an India program. And would you be kind enough to be able to to do it for us. And the point I'm trying to make is that most people in the United States see me and my company as the India expert. And no matter where you turn, uh, it will end up coming back to Amrit or to Gunjan one way or the other. Uh, for a more formal introduction, I'm a graduate of the IIT Kanpur, the Indian Institute of Technology at Kanpur, which was set up during President Kennedy's time by Caltech and MIT and seven other American universities. I was also the president of their 